So using the last template I just made here with the light and the floor reflections, I want to show you a photo shine. So that will really add to this effect and give it that glossy look. Let's go ahead and open up our project pane here. Command 4 will open up the layers and I want to duplicate this photo. So we're going to duplicate and what we're going to do is add a mask to this. So it's going to be kind of like the text effect where we had it shine. So I'm going to have this right here. It's probably not large enough. I actually know it's not large enough. I need to open this up and we're going to stretch this out. As large as our photo is. And that should do it right there. Let's just test it. Up, oh, not quite long enough. We can actually open up this way as well. Here we go. Now what we're going to do is turn off this bottom photo so we can see what we're masking. And let's add a glow. Just a regular glow. Let's also add, under color correction, levels. And now with that levels, we're going to go to our inspector. Blow that up a little bit. But make sure, again, these effects are on the photo. So there you go. It's going to change it. Move the mask around. Let's go ahead and add a feather, about 49. Let's open the bottom photo. So it looks better. See that? Yeah. Levels. I'm going to turn that up even more because that gives us the white look there. And so with this mask, we just want to keyframe it now. And we don't want to overdo the effect, but it is up to you and your preference. So I'm not going to overdo it here, though, in this part. So I'm going to hit record. I'm going to go about 47 frames in, 45. And then move it off the screen, off the photo. And there we go. So let's see what this looks like here. And I think that looks good. That's a cool effect, especially with this gray floor and the reflections. And you can change that and customize it. You can go into the template here. I hope you're following along with file 32. It's called Photoshine. And you can adjust this yourself and add your own photos. I've turned this into a drop zone so you can drop and drag your own photos into here easily.